Welcome to the Preacher's Bees. It's that time of year when the bees are out flying, looking for new homes. I set some swarm traps earlier this year and uh, come down here to check on one that I have set right beside a, a interstate in my area. And uh, gonna flip it around here and show you what it looks like. There you go. You can see they're coming and going out of there pretty good. So that is definitely not, uh, <laughs> that is definitely not scouts. That is most certainly a swarm in the trap. So I will let them sit here for probably another five to six days and then uh, I'll come back and pick these girls up. Because as I'm sitting here looking, the bees are coming and going, but I don't see anybody bringing pollen. Uh, they can be bringing nectar. I, I'm not sure exactly what they're doing, but uh, that is definitely a swarm in there. But I don't see any pollen coming in just yet. So they may have just come into the box today or yesterday or whatever, and uh, they're calling it home. So I won't mess with them for at least a week. Hey, it's a good day in the neighborhood and we thank the lord for it god is good all the time and all the time god is good we're gonna go check another trap we'll see what we find there well i'm here at my second spot I'm gonna try and zoom in there was a bee up there i don't know if I don't see it right now but there was one up there checking it out I just watched it go inside I stopped at my second one that one didn't have anything so I rebated it now this one I won't rebate because there is a bee inside right now but uh, I may come back in a couple of days and, and rebate this one. But uh, yeah, this one's out in the middle of farm fields. Oop, there we go, stay on it. This one's out in the middle of farm fields and uh, <clears throat> woods. There's a big woods over here. The second one that I have set, that one's set in about 7,000 acres of woodland and uh, that didn't seem to have anything looking at it, but I've caught one there before. So we'll see what happens. There's a bee. So they are checking this one out. Not very hot and heavy, but uh, they are checking this one out. There's a bee. So I won't bother with this one today. I'll let this alone today and we'll see what happens. Okay, I'm here at another one of my swarm traps, and it looks like I might have a swarm in here. So I'm going to turn this thing around and let you see what that looks like. Hang on. All right, it says it's recording. So I got bees going in. They are not scouting. I got here a couple minutes ago and they were, yeah, here comes some more. There goes one in with pollen. I saw a couple go in with pollen. More are just going in. I think they just took the box not long ago because they're bringing nectar in because they've got to build comb before they bring in uh, the pollen for the queen to actually start using that for laying, laying eggs to feed the brood and what have you. So they've got to get their colony in order. I'm assuming that they just took this box a day or two ago, and uh, yeah, they're they're buzzing around me. I'm kind of standing at their entrance. There goes another one with pollen. So yes, we definitely got us a, a swarm here. I don't know how big it is, but that's okay. Helping these girls out is the name of the game. So 
yeah we got quite a few here backing up behind me so yeah this is a good thing yep yeah it's looking good all right I will let these girls here for probably a week uh, starting today since I now know that it is definitely I got a notification two days ago that uh, there's bees at the box and uh, so I'll let them here for five days not a week five days because that'll be seven days there went another one with pollen so yes they have definitely taken the box and uh, we will come back Today is Thursday, so I'll probably come back on Tuesday or Wednesday to pick this box up of an evening. So, that means I have two boxes of bees, and uh, we'll see what things look like. Hey, doesn't get any better than this.